Welcome to the fourth season of the Olympus Anywhere Classroom, episode one. This season, we're gonna focus on the video capabilities of the OMD. That's why we're here in San Francisco with Olympus Trailblazer, Austin Latimer. Austin will show us how easy it is to shoot smooth, professional looking videos. In fact, this video was shot on the OMD. One thing that I really love about shooting skate videos is that there's so much dynamic motion that you can capture with it. There's just so many opportunities to get a really interesting composition and have it be moving. It's super simple to record video with the EM5 Mark II. All you have to do is find the red button, hit it, and you're recording video. You can also be taking stills while you're shooting video. So you can be filming something, hit the shutter button, take a still, and continue filming. So one of my favorite things about this system is that you can really be very portable. To get into some situations that I normally wouldn't be able to get into with a larger camera, just allows me to really be flexible and not really carry a whole lot of gear. One of my favorite lenses to use for this kind of video is the 12 to 40 Pro. It allows me to really get that wide angle perspective, but also to push in that can allow you to really capture all of the action. You want to be able to see the whole skater and be able to see everything that they're doing. If you just have a tight lens, you're only going to be able to see one part of it and they're going to be moving through it so quickly that you're not really going to be able to tell what's happening. What I try to look for when I'm, when I'm shooting skate videos is I, I try to find dynamic scenes that allow color and depth and have something in the foreground that can be moving. One of my favorite things is being able to move the camera and have that scene kind of shift around you and move with the subject. People don't think about how much the camera actually moves and it shakes and it actually takes you away from what you're watching if the camera's moving a lot. This camera has a five axis image stabilization system that allows it to really keep a solid, smooth image throughout your video so you can focus on what's actually happening in the video rather than being distracted about the camera moving around. So one of the really important things with shooting video is getting the right perspective. You want to be able to place the camera in a place that you can capture the entire motion throughout the scene because with photography you're just getting that one shot. But with video you got to think about the entire action that's happening through the scene. So placement of the camera becomes an extremely crucial component. One of the really nifty things about this camera is that it has this flip out screen that allows me to really shoot really high, look up on the screen, or shoot really low and be able to look down at the camera and not really have to be at the same level of the camera to get the shot that I need. Sometimes you just can't get the camera where you need to be with your person next to the camera and to be able to look through it. So by utilizing the OI Share app, you can access the camera remotely through your smartphone and be able to control video and photos to be able to get a perspective that I wouldn't normally be able to get. One of the features on the EM5 Mark II is that it has variable frame rates. You can shoot 24p and you can shoot 60p. If you want to create a slow motion dynamic for your video, you want to be shooting in 60p. 60p allows more frames to be recorded, so then when you slow it back down and play it at a slower rate, it ends up being smoother. 24p allows you to get that cinematic look that all feature films have been shot in. All right, you guys want to come over this way and just kind of hit this? With this shot, I shot it in 60p so then I can slow it down later, but sometimes you don't want to have to wait to put it in your computer to be able to use it. So I'm using a feature in this camera right now that allows me to have the playback in slow motion in the camera. You can really create some amazing images with this camera, with the video that comes out of it and the photos, the combined nature of having both with you is amazing. So get out there and play with your camera, experiment with the variable frame rates and just explore. To learn more about what you can do with the Olympus OMD series, visit getolympus.com forward slash anywhere classroom.